Hello everyone, it's Sarah here. I'm sick again. You must think I'm like the sickest person on the face of the earth. I am really not. I'm just having a very bad winter when it comes to colds and things. But I'm here because I pulled um, and the owl crate for January out of my mailbox just a moment ago. And um, I wasn't, I don't normally get owl crate. I decided to get it this time around because the theme seemed really, really great. And when I thought about it, I think I know what book is coming and it was one that I was interested in. And so I decided to go ahead and grab it. So let's see if I was correct. So, la la la. The um, theme this month was classic remix. The little card is very, very pretty. It's like an old fashioned movie theater this time around. And we have worms, of course, because what's life without worms? So the first thing I see in here, and I think I've seen these on Etsy before, um, are this little soap that's like a book. And this one is The Secret Garden. Again, my favorite classic book of all time. It's white tea and berries. So, and it comes with this, it has a cute little book. <clears throat> like an old book card from a library. So that's very, very cute. I think I smell something good, but I can't really smell, so I can't really tell you how things smell at this moment. Sorry. The next thing I see is, ooh, um, I love the teas from First Edition Tea Company. This one is The Little Prince. It is a mint and rose herbal tea. So I'll look forward to trying this out. Um, it says in it, peppermint, spearmint, osmanthus petals, ginger pieces, rose petals, and chamomile. So this really is truly just an herbal tea, um, which sounds like really good for my throat and sinuses. So I'll try that out. A little pin that says the Owl Crate Theater. <laughs> then we also have the Phantom de l'Opera. Gaston LaRue, and um, as we're getting into this, I'm thinking I might have been correct about the book. All right, let's see what's this. This came, what is this? A wa oh, a Wanderlust calendar. Bold graphic interpretations of great literary lines. Okay, oh, very nice. So they're like, it's a little calendar with a quote on the top for the month. I can make use of this. Definitely. And there's the different prints. That's kind of cool. All right, I'll take it. What else? I see the book. I was right. <laughs> okay, so... There also seems to be a promotion for Marissa's Myers Wires and Nerve Lunar Chronicle series graphic novel. So that's in there. And we have a bookmark that says everything was beautiful and nothing hurt. And I'm assuming this has something to do with the book, which is... Rose Blood by A.G. Howard. I was correct. This is supposed to be a Phantom of the Opera retelling. I have not read the Phantom of the Opera, but I have seen the musical and I love Broadway and I love that and I've seen the movie and you know, this is all good. I am very excited to read this. Oh, well now that's pretty cool. The words in the book, are written in, are not in black, they're written in red. That is really neat. Very, very cool. I'm looking forward to reading this in the next couple months and letting you know how I liked it. It of course also comes with um, a signed book plate and a letter from the author. They all come with that in the Owl Crate. 
I'm sorry if I didn't make much sense. I'm a little feverish and aki today, but I really wanted to unbox this for you and to see whether I was right. I like being right. All right, so now let me look at the spoiler thing and make sure I didn't miss anything or some anything that I was supposed to say. Mint Tea by First Edition Tea Company. The Soap by Tea Soap Books. Inspired by The Secret Garden. Oh, see, um, I was wrong about the bookmark because I haven't read the book that it came from. So this is um, from Lexi Olivia. This is a quote from Slaughterhouse-Five. Sorry, that was wrong of me. The Phantom of the Opera Magnet by Sweet Sequels. The Calendar designed by Obvious State. And the book. So I'm very pleased with my decision to purchase this box this month. And as always, they give you the theme for the next box, and that will be Run Away with the Circus. And the sneak peek is that it will include a delicious new item from Frostbeard Studio, which is candles. I have several of them. They are excellent. Um, whether or not I will subscribe to this one, I don't know yet. I'll have to think about it. I, not likely, because circuses kind of creep me out. So you'll have to go get your unboxing from another channel. So uh, I will see you again with another video. I hope everyone feels a whole lot better than I do. And I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.